Hello, this is Tsukihime. Welcome back to my Let's Play of Suikoden 1. Uh, last time, we actually stood up against General Teo's army, and we lost bitterly. Um, then we had uh, Pan decided to buy us some time by fighting General Teo, and he won by the skin of his teeth, and they let him live. Which I can't stress enough how important it is to let him live in that fight. But anyway, it's not that hard. It's just if he if he has the best defense in the in that you can get in the game so far and the best upgraded weapon that you can get for him so far, he should be okay. He should be up to snuff. But yeah. Anyway, this episode I came up on this floor and heard ominous music, so it must be something important going on. Let's go in here and talk to Matthew. The soldiers are exhausted. We need rest. Master Hero, your bed is ready. Please clear your mind and rest. What the hell is that? Our attacks are useless. Yeah, I know. I used all three different attacks, too. Armored Cavalry. Yep. Need to say more. Ah, and Pana actually is still here. And he's still complaining about food. And I'm still thinking about Teo, apparently. Okay, so let's go back. I guess he wants us to go to my room, so... Hero. Hero. Wake up, Hero. Hey, are you a star of destiny? Hero, you are lost and confused. Gremio's death, your battle with your father. You must go, but you must go on. Perhaps, but... Why must I? Perhaps, but... It is about time I tell you about myself and my older sister, Wendy. My sister, Wendy, and I are survivors of the Clan of the Gate. Hero, look at the rune Ted gave you on your right hand. That rune, the Soul Eater, is one of the 27 true runes. There are many runes in this world, but they were all born of the 27 true runes. Therefore, the 27 true runes hide terrible powers within them. That Soul Eater you carry is yet to unleash its true potential. My sister Wendy also carries one of the 27 true runes, the Gate Rune. The Gate Rune is terribly powerful, but she wants something greater. That is why she's after you. My sister obtains two true runes and uses them for revenge. It'll be catastrophic for this world. The true runes are far too powerful to be used by humans. Only you can stop my sister. Time is running out. Do not lose your confidence. Be brave. Wow, that was a fever dream for the ages. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, I got two 666 coins. That's, that's, that's wonderful. Okay. Yeah, so I kind of ruined before about the whole true rune thing, so sorry. It's a, a fundamental part of the... Why are you guys still standing there? Commander Hero, I was saved by Odessa. Um, that's good to know. Here, Master Hero, good news, Flick. Hey, listen up, leader. I have great I have a great idea. What is it? Tell me. Fire spears, remember? Sure, we delivered the blueprint to Sarity. If we can get those things, we should be able to defeat the armored cavalry. After all, the fire spear was Odessa's final gift. I don't know. When the old Liberation Army's hideout was attacked, it seemed that our other hideouts were destroyed as well. We don't know if the secret factory survived. But we have no choice but to find out. Hmm. Good point. Now I know. All I can do is go north where the secret factory was. We'll have to travel by water, of course. What, well, we need a bigger boat? Um... Yeah, pretty much. I think we need a better boat or something like that.
Actually, I gotta go back up again. I'm afraid this is one of those moments where the characters kind of reset when you move away from them. Yeah, I figured that. Yeah, I figured that. Wow. Okay. Change. Admit to party. Okay. Now I don't really care so much about Pan because he's still alive. I don't think he's ever going to be challenged like that again. So let's see. Hey, Kirkus. Oh, Kai. Oh, Flick. Okay. Okay, I got one more spot left, so I can actually use whoever I want. Um, hmm. What's the ranges of these people I already have? Medium, short, long, medium, short. Okay. Okay, so we can basically have anything we want, really. Alright. I think I will put Kasumi in the party. But let's do something about the formation first. Because Flick is in the back row and we don't want that. Let's see, Hero, Victor, Flick. Kasumi, Kirkus, Kai. That should be fine. Actually, item. Red paint. Alright, Victor has it. Okay, so let's just put the, the last bit of paint in that we have. Is he in here? Yes. There you go. So we're a little bit over, a little bit under halfway done. That's not bad. Alright. Don't use elevator. I want to go down another floor. Looks, it looks like some of the characters had some shit that I can throw out. Yes, I have loads of business in your vault. Let's see. Drop. really need sound setting zero. No setting, okay. Yeah, I wish I I wish I had the sense to come back here and do this, but I mean I had that storyline stuff going on. And there's nothing on her. Alright, we're good. Okay, let's go to the basement. Oh my god, what did they do to our ship? Hey boss. Not boss, master hero. Shut your mouth. Anyway, we have have a look at this, a high speed boat that I made. Well that old geezer helped out too. We're about to have a launching ceremony. Care to take a ride in it? Correction, maybe later. <laughs> yes, I'll take a test ride, sure. A novice can't possibly pilot this thing. Please bring someone who knows boats. Oh, I gotta bring a fisherman. Maybe. Who knows about boats? Alright, well, use elevator. Or floor. Don't make it tedious for me, Jen. I know how to freaking sail a boat. Oh shit. That's not what I wanted. Oh shit, I don't have any space. Alright, well I guess I gotta get rid of Kasumi. Oh well. 
<laughs> you were short-lived. Admit to party. I'm gonna guess that this is what, he, what he's talking about, sending a... someone who actually is a fisherman. I don't think it's a mandatory thing to be a fisherman and know how to boat. Just saying, I mean, there's a lot of people that go fishing, but they don't go on a boat. Alright, let's see if that's enough. Alright, yeah, we heard this. Let's take a, a test ride. Wow, this is really something. Everybody hang on. Let's go. Okay. I think it's a little bit faster, too. That looks sweet, doesn't it? I wish I didn't have to take a fisherman along with me, but oh well. So, traveling is a bit faster now. Oh yeah, it's definitely faster. Now, let's see, how do I get up there? Just go up straight up here, or...? Yes! Alright! Hang on a second, this is not where I wanted to go. Um... <laughs> well... I... I guess I can kind of explore here. Why do you have a music note on your head? And <laughs> your name is Melody. I'm nothing compared to you, but a runes master once told me that I have a special power. To use it, though, I need a rune. Okay. Remember that for later. We're not really supposed to be here yet, but at least we got it. At least we got this place down. Now, where do we go? Is it north up here? No? And that's a bridge. Don't want to go over to the bridge. Hmm. For once, I'm actually at a loss. Where do I go? Is it up here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um. <laughs> okay. That was a bit sudden. So why do we need a special boat? Well, let's go back. Oh, let me in. <laughs> I wonder if I can go around now without having to use a fisherman. Sorry, not very much happened to, uh, this episode. I was trying to to get stuff done, but... Oh, he's now a mandatory member of the party. <laughs> okay. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't, don't use elevator. Oh, Matthew, tell me where I'm supposed to go. No, he wants to change my party members too. Okay, so this is one of those uh, flying at the seat of your pants kind of thing. Let's see, basement. Or maybe that's where I'm supposed to go, who knows? Well, let's go back to that town that I went into momentarily, because I didn't think I had to go there. Actually, hang on, Mount Tiger Wolf. He's so confusing. No, oh, don't want to go there. All right, fine. I'll go back up there. I have a feeling I'm not supposed to be there, though. here at all.
That big house over there belongs to Kunto, the boss of Kirov. Who are you people? I'm just doing the laundry. Recruit! The Liberation Army? That should be plenty of laundry. Okay, I'll join. But only if you go get me some soap. I just ran out. Oh, this one. This one, this one, this one. So this is like one of the most annoying way, like uh, one of the most annoying NPCs to get. Not NPCs, Stars of Destiny. Sure, I have some soap and I'm glad to lend you some, but I'm out of soy sauce. Will you get some for me? Do you have an idea what's going to happen, viewers? <sighs> hey, you look special. My occupation is free man, you might say. To put it simply, I'm an idler. Why don't, you, why don't we play a game? If you beat me, I'll join you. A game of what? Listen to rules. What is this? It's easy. Flip two cards. If they match, they disappear. Make all the cards disappear within the time limit. You win. Even while a card is disappearing, you can flip the surrounding cards. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a game of memory, is it? This is a bit strange. But it doesn't look like he's a part of the whole... that whole quest thing. So let's, um... don't listen to the rules. play the first one. Okay. Whoa! That was weird. Okay, so Victor's here. We haven't seen that character yet. We'll see him later. Pretty good. How about another round? No, that's that's fine. I've already... Am I supposed to beat a record? Oh, I am. Oh, okay. Let's try it again, then. Beat him. A new record. Well done. Let's play again sometime. Okay, so that wasn't too hard. You win, as I promised. From now on, I'll be one of you. That was a weird game. Now, I don't think you ever get any money for it either, so... It's pretty pointless, but anyway. Anyway, I gotta look for somebody who has soy sauce. Aren't you supposed to be behind the counter? I'm just saying. Don't remember, not to remember it. Okay. Soy sauce, sure, but only if you get me some salt. Oh, it's this quest. I need to find a special room for Melody. Wasn't quite sure what was going on there, I just kind of lagged out. Uh, where am I going? Maybe it's you. Salt? Sure, I have plenty of salt, but first, can you find me a yardstick? I seem to have misplaced mine. Still no one in here. I need to find someone who has a yardstick now. Yep, this is one of those kind of quests and it's as annoying as hell. Yeah, I know. I gotta find someone who has a yardstick. Maybe this guy in here, who knows. A yardstick, right? I've got one. But you know what I need? But you, but you do know that I need sugar, right? <sighs> sugar! Wow. This is like the, one of the most annoying characters you can get in the game, I think. 
No, I already talked to you with the soy sauce. Can I buy any of this? Ah, sugar! Alright. What's the sacrificial Buddha? Oh, I see. Double experience. Sweet. Sugar! Alright, so. Now that we've got the sugar, now we gotta deliver it to whoever it was. He was in the inn, I think. Give him the sugar. And then he gives me the yardstick. Now I gotta find the person who wanted the yardstick. <laughs> oh my god. This was one of the ones... If anything, the one person that I missed on my first playthrough was this girl. Let's see. So I deliver the yardstick to her. And then she gives me salt. You don't need... Yeah, you don't need that. Alright. You deliver salt to him. Then he gives me soy sauce. And I deliver the soy sauce. By the way, I have another favor. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Here's some soap. <laughs> soap acquired. And then we talk to her. Oh, you brought me soap. It turns out I had some, but... <laughs> My name is Sarah. How do you do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I got this fucking soap! Okay. Calm down. Calm down. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> oh god. I got a headache. <laughs> Head desking like that probably wasn't the best idea. Okay. Um. Anyway. Uh. Next time. <laughs> oh. Alright, next time we'll find Seika and get, try to get the... try to see if the fire spears have been worked on. And, because basically we have nothing else to do and that's our best option right now. Anyway, wow. This is a very dizzy Tsukihime signing off. Have a good day. <laughs>